Kieran Phillips, new contract until 2025. How are you feeling? Yeah, I'm really happy, mate. Um, this is obviously my first club, um, so it's a real special moment for me uh, to sign this deal here. As you say, it was your, your first club when you were eight. You were here until you were 13 before you went to Everton. Is it, uh, does it mean more to you to have, have progressed in this way with town? Yeah, definitely. I mean, my first ever football game watching town at the stadium, um, watching John Rose score goals and uh, Andy Booth. Um, so, you know, it's, it's really special for me. You had a, a couple of, of interesting years, shall we say, um, when you were around 16. You were out for a, a two, two and a half years with a, a knee issue. Do you want to just talk people through that? Because it's quite an interesting period of your career, isn't it? Yeah, so uh, when I was 16, I was uh, essentially bed-bound for three months. Um, I um, had a degenerative disease in my knees, uh, bone, bone-related, so... Um, I had several operations um, to fix that, and it took me took me two years to get back um, back fit. Um, and uh, luckily, uh, through hard work, I've persevered, and uh, here I am. So it just makes it even more special. Yeah, you, you had the period with Everton that we touched on, and then you, you came back to town initially on loan, and then and then permanently. How's it been since you've been back at Huddersfield? Yeah, it's been great. I mean, uh, this is home to me. The, the club's home. Um, I'm a West Yorkshire lad anyway. So um, I've just I've loved every minute, uh, and I'm happy that I'm going to be spending my future. As you say, your future here, sir. You're 21 at the moment, 22 next month. This contract will take you to around 25. That shows a bit of faith and, and a real support from the club in, in your ability. Yeah, massively. I mean, um, it, it shows everything from the club uh, how highly they think of me, which obviously must give me confidence. Um, and hopefully, I can I can give that back to the club, give that back to the fans, and next year when I come back, uh, show them what I can do. Those high hopes are shown as well. You've, you've already played in the Championship for town. How was that for you? Is that, is that the long-term aim for you, obviously, is to, to get into the first team here? Yeah, obviously, I got a little taste of it last year, like you say. Um, but I'm hoping next year I can really push on, uh, try, and get, try and get starts, try and get in the, uh, in the first team and cement my place in there and uh, hopefully go from there. This year you, you've been on loan with Walsall. You've got five goals in all competitions, including your first league goals. How's that experience been for you? Yeah, it's been excellent. Um, it's been been very different. You know, first time playing in front of fans. Um, I've been playing out of position for most of the most of the time, but again, it's making me more versatile. Um, so I can play in any any of the front three now. Um, so. Everything happens for a reason, you know what I mean? So, uh, yeah, really enjoyed it. You, you're feeling your game's coming on there, and obviously League Two is not an easy division to be playing and scoring in, but it seems to be something that you've, you've taken to quite easily. Yeah, it's, uh, it's very different, um, but like I say, I'm, I've really enjoyed it. I think the game's come on massively since I've been there, grown in confidence, um, realised a few attributes that I probably didn't know I had before because I'm playing in a different position, uh, which can only go on and benefit me in the future. Next season, you'll obviously be wanting to, to show what you can do here or, or possibly even step up the divisions on another loan. Is all of this and, and having your development looked after so closely by town one of the reasons why you're doing so well? Uh, yeah, 100%. I mean, they're closely monitoring me, so I'm having, I'm having meetings here every, every few weeks uh, to check up uh, to make sure that I'm going in, in one direction. Um, obviously, there'll be ups and downs, but if we can keep it going upwards, uh, can't really go wrong. Kieran, congratulations on the new contract and uh, good luck for the future. Yeah, thank you very much. Cheers.